I'm Lloyd Bracey and I've been looking at the face of Britain in the 1990s through the eyes of a rather controversial artist. And is this how you'd sum up Britain in the 90s? An artist who stuck John Major's face onto the Mona Lisa says his work has been misunderstood. Peter Kennard's put his masterpiece on show at Eastbourne. He says it illustrates the state of Britain in the 90s. Critics, though, say it's childish rubbish. Lloyd Bracey reports. The Britain Peter Kennard portrays is a land of decay, dust and despair. Images of what he calls 13 sad years. But among his photomontage collection, one in particular has got people talking. I, I honestly, I, it doesn't make any sense. I can't see the point. It doesn't convey anything to you at all? Not a lot, no. Do you think it's except good art? The, except the Mona Lisa doesn't smile and he doesn't, I suppose. It's a bit of fun, really. I mean, I'm, I'm, I think some of the other pictures in there are a little more interesting. Well, weird. Well, it's, it's very funny, yeah. Yeah, I enjoyed that. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. You know what, some people will regard it as funny. Personally, I think it's rather childish. To me, it's on the same level as a child who scribbles on magazines, yeah, puts beards on the ladies and all that sort of thing. It's only one of 26 pieces, all in stark black and white, all with the same theme, a two-faced country where a facade hides the true state of the nation, as the artist sees it. I've tried to show that beneath the image people have of Britain, the, the postcard image and the tourist image, there is in fact incredible poverty, rising poverty and deepening poverty. It has been described, particularly your Mr Major alias the Mona Lisa, mm. as um, like childish scribblings on a magazine. How would you react to that? Well, I mean, I'd consider that incredibly childish comment coming from a conservative councillor as well, when you consider what the Conservatives are up to at the moment, I would have thought he had better things to make comments about. Like it or loathe it, at least they're talking about it. And as someone once said, the only thing worse than being talked about is not being talked about. Lloyd Bracey, Coast to Coast, Eastbourne. <laughs>